Hey guys, George here with Legendary DIY. Today I'm going to show you how to remove the aerator from your Moen kitchen faucet. Uh, today we have a Moen Brecklin kitchen faucet. Um, so, here we go. Now on these, they're a little bit different than your normal ones. These don't actually come with a aerator key when you get it brand new. And as far as I know, they don't make a key for this. So what you have to do is uh, get something that'll go in between these grooves to twist it out. So what I'm gonna use is a uh, Allen key. So we're gonna get it in between those two grooves and we're gonna twist it to the left or counterclockwise. And you see how the whole thing spins, okay? It means you're doing good and you twist out. Once you get it loose enough, you can just use your thumbs. So, and be careful when you're doing this, some stuff might fall out. On my faucet, I've already removed my water saver and the strainer that came for the, the spray head. So there's nothing in here to lose. But I uh, just wanted to show you guys how to remove the aerator um, in case you, you know, you're know you getting low flow or you want to remove the water saver like I did so you can have a little bit more flow than what's standard. So to put it back together, it's just the opposite. You get it lined up, twist it to the right or clockwise. Get it as tight as you can by hand and then go ahead and get your allen key or whatever you use to get in those slots and just just give it a little bit more maybe about another quarter turn and you're good so you'll want to turn it on make sure you're not getting any random drips out of there so everything looks good hope you enjoyed the video guys that's how you remove your aerator from your own kitchen faucet um, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and uh, have a good day.